Hi, this is Andy, and today I will tell you how to share a Teams recording in 2025. To do this in Microsoft Teams, you need to go to the Teams tab, then go to the Files tab and enter the Recordings folder. After that, you need to hover over the desired meeting and click on this button. Here, a window will appear where we can list all the participants with whom we will share the recording. We can also add messages to them if necessary and choose what access they will have. We can also simply copy the link and share it with colleagues. And you can also configure this link and choose what access it will have. Once everything is ready, just click the Send button. Now I want to show you how to record and share recordings using Blue Dot. During a meeting in Microsoft Teams, you need to hover over the extension icon. Here you can choose a template, select a language. Blue Dot supports over 100 languages and then just click the Start Capture button. After that, Blue Dot will immediately start recording and analyzing the meeting in the background. And it is up to you to decide whether to notify participants about the recording or not. And to get the recording result, you can simply leave it and Blue Dot will open a link to your meeting in a new tab. Here you can immediately review it and wait for the transcript to be generated. And this is what the meeting recording looks like in a live example. On the right side, Blue Dot generates a full transcript of the meeting. It also identifies the speakers. And on the left side, Blue Dot generates an AI summary of the meeting. It also generates an overview and topics. And if necessary, you can change the note template, for example, to sales notes. And Blue Dot will regenerate the AI summary based on the note template. And to share this recording with colleagues, you can click the share button. In this window, you can list the colleagues who will have access to the recording or you can provide access via link. You can also share a specific segment of your video. To do this, you can highlight a portion of the transcript and create a separate clip. And in the Clips tab, you can copy the link to a specific section of your meeting and share it with colleagues. I hope this video was helpful and helped solve your problem. Goodbye, everyone.